Hey there, friends, and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White, and today we'll be playing through the next part of The Last of Us Part 2. I hope you're ready. Get your emotional pants on. Emotional pants? You know, it's going to be an emotional ride, this game. So, you know, just make sure you have pants on. I don't know. I, who knows where I'm going with this intro. Anyways, take a second to like the video before we begin as I thank our patron of the day, Deno. Deno, thank you so much for supporting on Patreon. It is so incredible of you to support in the amazing and varied ways that you have, whether it's on Twitch, whether it's on Patreon, whether it's in the Discord. Your energy and enthusiasm is totally infectious, and I really, really, really appreciate you. You're a wonderful addition to the community, and I'm glad you're here. And now, let's get on to that gameplay video. Enjoy. I see a bunch of different tracks. What do you think? Divide and conquer? No, stay together. Sounds like a plan. Run it. No. Good old Ellie Shiv. It's down. That's one. Divide and conquer, right? No, stick together. Let's see if we can get around to the back of the supermarket. Good idea. Never separate. That's how you get into trouble. Okay. So that door is locked. Ooh, the music kicks up. Okay, so we go, could go out the window, but there's also this door. Let's see what's through here. Okay. Strike stunned enemies to yeah. deal significant damage. I see. Nice throw, by the way. Thanks. That's why you always gotta carry a brick. The way we came in was barricaded. How'd that runner get in here? Yeah, it's a good question. What's the most infected you've ever taken down on patrol? It's gotta be the one I had with Joel a year or so ago. It was like, I don't know, a dozen? You? Cleared about 20 once. There was a group passing through. Fuck. I feel like I'm Ellie handled record today. more than that with Joel when she was just a kiddo. Take. There's nothing in this drawer. I feel cheated. Take. Okay. So this room seems to be pretty isolated. So, cause everything's barricaded. So let's go, wait, I'm turned around. How did we get in here? Where's the door? Where's the door we came in through? What just happened? I thought it was right here. Oh, it's right there. Oh my gosh, wait. We can't go back? Oh, I see, okay. Dina. That was terrifying. Way. More runners. Let's keep it quiet. <laughs> Dang, Ellie. It's very intense. 
They did such a good job animating that. It's so creepy. that guy stays over there. Gosh, it's just crazy to turn the camera around and watch Ellie go crazy like that. It's so weird. Is that all of them? Yeah. Looks like it. We still gotta get the ones in the supermarket. Let's keep circling the building. <gasps> There's gotta be a way in. A brick! Dun, 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 dun. And now we have a brick. All is right with the world again. There's nothing in these drawers either! It's so unfair. All I want is stuff. Okay. She wants a boost, huh? Those backpacks look pretty useful, actually. If I was Ellie, I would take those backpacks. I'm sure they could be used for something. See, sometimes there's things shining, but it's not a thing. All right, here's your boost. Off you go. Um, there's a hole in the roof over there. Here. Let me up. Button. Oh, I have to jump. I thought I had to press triangle. I'm getting my games mixed up. Thanks. Look, see? All right, let's figure out how to get in there. Here, Key. Let's figure out how to get in there. Well, we could crawl under that. It seems like that's probably what we're gonna end up doing. So down we go. Are you coming? You are. Down we go. Dina, under here. She doesn't Please know she's immune. Older, not because you get infected. I really don't want to have to shoot you in the face. Dina doesn't know. Yeah. Deal. Cool. So nobody knows but Joel and Tommy. And maybe Maria? Interesting. Dina doesn't know. Okay. How's that gonna play in, I wonder? Why would they have this little cave back here if there's not going to be any stuff back here? Hmm. Missed opportunity. See any way to that roof? 
I'm not sure. Okay, so that's our way up, but what's over here? Stuff for the taking! Ha ha ha! Take some pills and a letter. Actually, yeah. Nice. Ma'am, I'm sorry to God for what I did. I wasn't going to hurt you. I didn't want anything from your store except for the drugs. Your husband came at me. What choice did I have? My little sister stopped feeling her feet. I needed the insulin. Everyone is hoarding this stuff. What choice did I have? I hope he survives. I'm sorry. So... Some person had to shoot the husband but didn't want to kill him, but needed insulin because everyone else is hoarding insulin. Sad. Take that supplement, though. We need 30, and now we have 8. I need health. We don't have a health kit. Well then. I don't really know what to make of that. Take. honest this this game feels a lot like uncharted there are a, there's a lot of jumping and crouching and this feels a lot like uncharted a lot more than the original last of us i feel like so interesting I, I really did not expect that at all i'm in Alcohol! Got some alcohol. A couple of rags. Molotov cocktail! Yeah. Fix yourself up. Oh, health instead. Fine. See spores in there. Masks Mask on. up. Got it. COVID safe. Even though Ellie is immune, but Dina doesn't know. Ah, good old dry erase marker whiteboard. Do we need a website update? No, you didn't. You didn't know that you didn't, but you didn't. Practice hard work and focus and we have filled in hard work and focus but not practice <laughs> they needed to practice more gross profits up 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 that's what you want your charts to look like very official business whole foods market okay is this not the whole foods logo feel like it is. Q4 display. Christmas patterns. Take. Anything else in these drawers? Why did business people put ammo in their filing cabinet? That's what I want to know. Goals, Q4 to Q1, higher social engagement and continue 404 growth. Keep FID spend 
to 20% of overall marketing budget. Grow customer retention program by 6%. Demographic. Oh, demographic. <laughs> I thought it meant to be like a sample graphic. Like, <laughs> here's a demo of what a graphic should look like. <laughs> no, it's demographic. <laughs> 2013, 2014 market goals, brand profits, revenue, brand refresh, differential bookshelves, bar shelves from our, I can't read all this. It's business talk. All right. Um, okay. Let's go into this door. Remember. I don't want to have to shoot you in the face. Oh, that's so sweet. Um, the bigger picture is that we don't want to have to shoot mean they've been Dina in the face. Keep your eyes peeled for older infected. Yep. Is this part of the supermarket? I don't know. I think we're above it. Let's get to the ground floor. Ingredients are found in pieces. Whole ingredients are needed to craft an item. Okay. Take, take. Ooh. It's definitely some older infected gonna be present here. Yuck. 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 I pull that open. Take. Nice. And what's in here? Oh, I don't know the combination for that. But I'd like to. Take. What would the combination be? Ah. Yo, Kristen, left the real shit in the safe for you. Combo is the date my good boy got employee of the month. Don't fucking sell those or give them away. That's for your back, all right? Feel better. Good boy got employee of the month on what date? It would have been... We need a calendar. Huh, how do we know what date good boy got employee of the month? Maybe it's posted somewhere else. Aha! July 2013. Well then. So that would be 07. Twenty thirteen. Ha 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 What do we have here? Take, 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 take. All right, that is good stuff. All right, nailed it. Way to go. What do we have in here? Nothing. Lame. This looks like a break room. Excellent compliance. Employer's code. Stop the spread. 
Wash your hands, sneeze into tissues, and wear a mask. That's COVID-friendly guidelines right there. Take. Nothing. A vending machine with only the gross candies left in there. Take! All right. We have 37 supplements now. All right. What are we gonna upgrade? Listen mode movement speed. Eh. Oh. We have to learn this? Oh, we need a training manual to unlock new branches. I don't know how long until I un get those training manuals. So I guess I'm just gonna spend the points. YOLO. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Well, that's inconvenient. Shoot! Correctly, these can't sense light. So we can have our flashlights on. And that means we can sneak up on yonder clicker. Don't walk into us. Oh, we can face it, because it can't see. All right, cool. Good note. I remember that. These blind motherfuckers make my skin crawl. All right. Let's make sure the rest of the building's cleared out. And then get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Speak in my language. But Dina, what you forgot to say was, let's make sure that we pick up everything that we could possibly take, and then we can get out of here. Because what's more important? Living or taking as much stuff as we can hoard? And I think we all know the answer. What do we have in this cooler? Take. Some ammo. Ellie, found the door. Help me out? Well, do you know what's on the other side of that door? Did you listen with your listen ab ability? Weston's We Care! Do you care though, Weston's? Do you? Okay. Pretty sure we looked, you know, pretty decent amount there. All right, get your flu shots, everyone. <laughs> lift from your knees. What she means is don't lift with your back. Lift with your legs. That's a safety pro tip right there. I'll make you a present. I'll take a present. Ah, take, take, I will take. <gasps> now a Molotov cocktail? Here, thanks. Light everyone on fire. Molotov set fire in an area. 
Hold L2 to aim and press R2 to arc throw! Careful with that. I'm a pro. We're not done. Take. Now, how is our health kit situation looking? Not good. Not good at all. Okay. Take? Yes, please. Quite a bit of supplements there. Take those, too. Hello, and thank you. Wow, look at all these goodies. Take, 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 take. Aha, and now we have enough to unlock faster health kits. And so I say once again, YOLO. Which is why you need more health kits, because YOLO. All right, uh, are we going through this window then, or? Yeah, we're probably going through this window. <laughs> All right, we have a runner. I got some numbers here. And clicker. What do you think? So. Get the runners first. Yeah. Let's see. <laughs> wow, this screaming in this echoey chamber, it's really, really gonna bother me. Very creepy! I pressed the wrong button. I was trying to listen and I ended up sprinting. Big mistake. Dina, could you get down while there are still runners around here? Police. if you're gonna hit all the trays. Dina, could you be stealthy, please? Oh, I did it again. Okay, listening is R1, Brianna. Do not make that mistake again. Okay, clickers, I'm gonna ask that you, you know, go away. Where's that other runner? All right, clicker there. It's fine, it's fine. They're not gonna turn around. Oh, I feel like they're so close to me. Ah! <laughs> It's my first death. It's my first death. <sighs> okay. I don't know exactly what set it off. Maybe I just was walking too fast. I don't know. I definitely didn't. Run. So I don't really know what set it off. It doesn't seem 
seem very stealthy. It seems very loud, as a matter of fact. But I guess we'll go with it. Okay, you seem the most isolated next, so I think we'll go with you. Slowly. Slowly. You are outpacing me at this point. There we go. <laughs> Creepy fungus corpse. Okay, there's a runner there. Now, the runners will see me. So, I wish I could see their shape a little bit better. So I know which way they're facing. Okay. Another one down. The tension. It is very high. Take. But I still will take to my heart's content. Okay. Ah, take. Okay. This room seems to be pretty clear here. Will this make noise? Not really. That's good. Okay. Now, where is... I think the last one. The last of them. Stealth is really kind of boring, honestly. <laughs> All right, nailed it, basically. And there's Any more. Still moving? Mm. Ah, no, we're good. Okay. Nope. You know what? I'm impressed with us. Dina, okay. I'm gonna ask you what you did Let's there. Take next look out and take a fucking break. We earned it. We, Dina, we. Wait, do you see a way out? Huh? <laughs> yeah, that garage door. But first, I have to make sure that I've checked most of the areas, if not all, at least most. For stuff, you know, cards or what have you. Little interactables, anything that we can find. I guess we could run. Might be more helpful. All right, well, we tried. I won't budge. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. You're just gonna... Hurl me up through that hole in the roof. Really? <laughs> okay. Right. This is gonna go great. And and how exactly am I gonna hurl you? Dina. Must not be the answer then. <laughs> can't climb onto this. I can't climb onto okay. this. Table. Oh, took you long enough. Help me out. Thank you. 
There we go. Yeah. That should hold us. So are we tossing it over the thing then? Yeah, we are. Get over. Fuck yeah. You know, that's just an AC duct, and you happen to okay, throw it at the good. weakest part. Here I go. You really couldn't have thrown it over, like, a support beam or something? No? Okay. Careful when you get up here. Yeah, climb faster is right. Making me nervous. Over here. Horses. Woo! That's fun. I guess I could have waited for really Dina to clear, up. but I didn't. How far are we from the lookout? It's just past the next town. Following you. Miserable. Cold places are the worst. I stand by it. This is getting worse. You turn back. We won't make it. We're almost there. Why do I hear tree branches and I feel like it's clickers? Horse needs a blanket. I don't like this. I don't like that I feel like I lost her. Tree branches sound like clickers. Oh, we're taking the horse in there? That's, that's probably the right call. And here's the worst part. It's probably still heckin' cold inside. I'll get the door. You been here? Rode by it. Never came inside. That means there's stuff in here. Right, let's make sure it's clear. No food or drink allowed. Quiet, please. Okay. Do you think it still smells like old books? Or do you think the cold kind of like takes the scent out. I feel like when it's really cold, things don't smell as much, you know? Like warmth amplifies smells. But I feel like cold does the opposite. Horses, you're being very loud right now, I want you to know. If we were trying to be stealthy, you would be ruining this for us. Doesn't feel like anyone's been here in a while. Shit. I gotta see what's back there. I mean, I did notice these giant, flimsy, broken windows. Just a thought. Can't lock a window. Wow! I called it! I did not expect that. We weren't, we didn't break any glass in the first one. We're not gonna do that. 
Oh, but my brick. It's not a great throw. But then what's in this guy? Oh, you're chained. All right. Someone's locked this place up. There's something back there. I think I see a bed. Yeah. Is that a squatter? We gotta check that out. I see another way in. <laughs> Whoa! Glass on your hands! What's going on here? Library copy room etiquette do's and don'ts. Do reset copier settings when you are finished. This has to be Eugene's. Are you sure? Yeah, nobody else would tinker with this shit. But why would he hide it from me? Huh. So what was Eugene doing? It's kind of suspicious. Take. Wow, what was Eugene doing? This is not just some hobbyist stuff. Wow, look at all these circuitry notes. Too complicated for me, that's for sure. What is this? What is this pendant? Looks like a firefly pendant to me, but I can't pick it up and examine it, so maybe it's not. Huh. Definitely Eugene's place. Okay. He was a firefly? He served with Tommy. I'm not gonna say I called it, but... We'll just go ahead and move on. Idea. Yeah. They got into some real dark shit. And all because okay. I was looking at the circuitry. He said he blew up a checkpoint at Denver QZ. Killed three soldiers. And two civilians. Jesus. He also told me that he and Tommy slow tortured some big Fedra general. I don't know. I, I don't buy Tommy doing that though. Joel would do worse. What do you mean? He and Joel did a lot to survive after the outbreak. Giraffe toy. Was Eugene in touch with other fireflies? Did he hear about me and Joel? No, he would have said something. Story time. Yeah, wow, there is a lot of collected electronics here. Okay. A card! Take! Rebels of Fire again! Wow. Best magazine ever! Okay. Leon Focal, CEO, Spark. 100 points brains, 20 points brawn. Born with a brilliant mind but hobbled by numerous physical ailments, Laurent Foucault spent his formative years in hospitals. Earning his MD PhD at age 15, he developed a cure for his rare genetic disease, the patents for which made him a multimillionaire overnight. With a few short years, he turned millions into billions, giving him the capital to build the SciTech Empire Spark and free reign to pursue knowledge and progress at any cost. Rumors circulate that Spark has developed methods to infuse newborns with specific superpowers, but Foucault has denied these ridiculous claims. And he's a villain. 
yeah, I mean, he looks a lot like Lex Luthor. And, and, you know, why are all billionaires villains? Why can't some villains be poor and some heroes also be billionaires? Why can't someone who's rich also have a heart of gold? I'm just saying. Okay, so got ourselves a collectible here. Need help? Ask a librarian. They're all dead. Yeah, I mean, it's weird to see a kid's story time area. What was he doing? What is this, electroplating? What was going on here? Hey, look, another play box, a PlayStation. Please do not reshell materials. Okay, did I miss anything over in this corner? Doesn't seem like it. Here's the bed. There's nobody home. What do we have here? Eugene, I'm begging you to come home. The Fireflies want to save the world. I say let them. Let them go after the military, the politicians. Let them develop a vaccine to save my mankind. Maybe one day we'll live to see the results of their fantasies. Until then, I have to put our daughter first. The Fireflies will be fine without you. Your daughters won't. She keeps asking me when you're coming home. I can't lie to her anymore. I miss you, but I don't know how much more of this I can take. Come home, please. We love you. Claire. Oh, Eugene. You had a family. So he we know he died at the ripe old age of 76 due to due to a stroke. But what we don't know, is this a bench? But what we don't know is how his family plans worked into that. Did he come into the compound after his family oh my died? God. It's Tommy and Eugene. Wow. The babies here. They do. Can't flip it though. It is Polaroid. Lights, heaters. There's gotta be a generator. Dartboard again! And I still can't play. Shameful. Hey, found the generator. This looks like a workbench, but I guess I can't use it? Maybe we do the generator first. I hate that. Oh, I hate that they turn that into a mini game. Oh, wow. Impressive workbench, Eugene. Workbench! Really Upgrades! Oh, I will. Oh, I will mod my gun with this gear. You just watch me. Parts and supplements are scarce. Use these resources wisely. Pass. Uh, inspect? What? I don't want to just look at it. What, what does that do me? Upgrades? Stability. Capacity. Scope. Fire rate. Stability, recoil, capacity. Hmm, if it were me, I think I'm going to end up using the pistol more than the rifle. 
So I think I would rather just spend my first 80 on stability and recoil so that my aim is better because thus far in the game, my aim has been pretty poor. So knowing me, it would be better to help me aim more accurately than I'm worried about fire rate or capacity. Because for the most part, I am a stealth killer in this game. But usually what happens is I get like halfway through with stealth and then I get, you know, found out. And then you have to like quickly use your guns in a high energy situation. And my aim is just not good in high energy situations. So while we're here, I'm just gonna go with this. Yeah, this'll work. And then I'm gonna go with, thank you, Dina. I'm gonna go with stability. I'm not a gun expert, but I don't necessarily know how just like filing the grip is going to make your stability better, but, but I'm not a gun expert. I'm not a gun expert. All right, cool, we nailed it. Good job, us. Now, do we wanna unlock oh, this? Hello. We cannot. Hello, what? Ellie, look at the floor. Ho ho! There is an even secret workshop there underneath the secret workshop. Not here. Interesting. So we gotta find a way to get down into the secret workshop. That is an elevator. Are we gonna use the elevator, Dina? Apparently not. But if there's an elevator, there are stairs. So thusly, we'll take the stairs. I swear to God, if you are standing by the elevator. Dina, we are gonna be in an argument. <sighs> really? Really? Come on. Wait, this isn't even a reference to the elevator. Okay, we're cool. It's fine. <laughs> Had nothing to do with the elevator. What's he it's fine. down here? Well, it's obviously a sex den. That's why he didn't tell you about it. I hope it's a sex den, for his sake. He was so lonely, man. It's probably just like a giant TV he didn't want to share. It's probably more than that. Oh my god. That's why Eugene it's always had it on him. Oh my gosh. This explains a lot. Wow. Wow. Eugene was a pothead. My goodness. Why did he want to keep this secret? Got little starters here. Hey, he's got that videotape thing. Huh. Dong of the wolf. Smash Brandy's cooch. Are these? It's porn. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting taste, Eugene. Yeah, that's porn. 
Um, so this is Eugene's just like secret place for all of his secret things. Maria would lose her shit if she saw this place. <laughs> How'd he get this together? Must have taken him forever. I wish he'd told me about this. Could have helped him out. I mean, how much time was he spending here? And like, how much of that time was like completely unaccounted for with his group? Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's a gas mask bong. God, he was so smart. That's not smart. That's stoner brain. Wow, my goodness. <laughs> it's a bottle of Jack Daniels. They turned it into a hookah. It's funny. Okay. Reroll. Huh. He was prepared. Oh, there we go. You think it's still good? Does weed go bad? Hmm. Let's find out. <laughs> you having a hard time? No, oh, I got it. <sighs> Fuck. Give me that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like you're gonna get it. She's just gonna break it. <laughs> okay. It's. Yeah. Just break it. Oh, fuck it. What the fuck <laughs> is wrong with you? <laughs> I got it open, didn't I? <sighs> uh. this smells good. I mean, we're gonna be stuck here a while, right? It's so irresponsible. Totally trapped. Can I ask you a question? I don't know, can you? Real cool, Ellie. Scale of one to ten. One being like absolute trash. And ten being life altering. How would you rate our kiss from last night? Why are we still talking about this? You said it was a mistake. Did I say that? What are you doing? I asked you to rate our kiss. I don't know. I give it a six. A six? <laughs> Like a solid six. Okay. There are a lot of people around. Yeah, but six. Oh. What? I mean, now I really want to know how you'd rate it. Poor Ellie. I don't think you do. Oh, poor Ellie. You're infuriating. Have you met you? You make me want to go back outside into that blizzard. Don't want to stop in you. <laughs> You're just like trading insults back and forth and it's totally flirting. This better be better than a sex. So that probably answers Ellie's question. 
Although, it's not, it wasn't really a question for Ellie. Ellie was just thinking that there's no way Dina could actually be into her. But that pretty much confirms that, that she is. Which is nice. I want them to be happy. I want that for them. Although, I am a classic worrier, and I go, Ellie just flicked that blunt into a bunch of dry leaves. It's gonna catch fire. I'm just, I'm a worrier. Also, like, what happens if infected or clickers walk in while they're high? Like, they're not gonna be, uh, they have their wits about them to protect their own lives. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, I'm a worrier. And now we're back to Angry Abby. Okay. Great, infected. That looks like a runner. Can I sneak in a snowstorm? This is not going to go well for me. Shit! Shit! I'm not going to make that! I don't even know where I'm going! Feets are gonna freeze. I'm super dead. Yeah, super dead. I had no idea which direction to go, and my doubt is what got me killed. Yeah. Anyways, continue trying again. to where they can't get me. Is 
Some bitches are everywhere. Get to the Was so Tony. well done. That's Joe. What's your name? Abby. Abby, are you okay? Yeah. That ain't gonna hold. We gotta go back. We ain't out running all the way, Jackson. We need to barricade that door. Tommy, we cannot stay here. The horses ain't making it all no, that no, my way. My friends, my friends are at a mansion just north of here. It's fenced in. We have the whole perimeter secure. Sit Baldwin, please. I can work. I'll get the door. Right. You ride with me. Come on. She's definitely making some weird faces. Don't know what that means, and I don't like it. This one. When I was 12, I found a skateboard. Uh oh. And I tried to get on it. <laughs> and it shot right out from underneath me. <laughs> That's Wait, a pretty big a scar I for falling. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Um, 
chemical burn. Mm. I hate to hurt myself. Why? Uh... To cover a bite mark? Right here. Okay. I got jumped by an infected when I was 14. And it turns out I'm immune. So it healed with a ring of fucked up teeth marks and cysts and Ow! She doesn't you. believe her. Well, she doesn't uh, believe her. Hey. <laughs> I told you a real fucking story. I did tell you a real fucking story. Oh, you want a bite mark? Uh, do you hear that? Jesse? Just stay there, okay? Are you just, okay? Just, just, so wait, awkward wait. for Jesse. What? Just turn around. What are you doing? Are you kidding me? <laughs> You're supposed to be on patrol. There's a blizzard outside. Is that weed? Why are you here? People are counting on you. You get that? What we do matters. Well, then why aren't you at the fucking lookout? Because Tommy and Joel didn't show up. What do you mean? We waited for them for an hour. I was looking for their horses when I saw lights. Maybe they just went back to town. Without being replaced? No way. How much of their region have you covered? Not much. Then we split up. Go at it from different sides, and we can cover the whole thing in a few hours. I don't like you riding solo. We don't know what's out there. Exactly. What if they need help? Okay, I'll head west, Dina can take south, and you come from the east, but be smart about it, yeah? Yeah. Dina and Ellie are supposedly high right now. I know, I'm being a grandma, but I'm like, they can't do anything, clearly, right now. think about is how dangerous fires are when there's no fire department to contain them. How are you guys doing? We're good. Thanks. Yeah. Can I talk to you for a minute? You want to get those saddles off? No, no. It's all right. We'll just ride out the storm and get out here. Oh, got any brushes or a towel or anything? You are nothing but lucky. Hey, you have no idea. Don't y'all get electricity in here? Have you been? There are solar panels on the roof. Who are these people? How long y'all been here? Since yesterday. Yesterday? Yep. What are y'all doing out this way? I'm just passing through. You two live nearby? We do. A few hours down the hill. Y'all should come back with us, restock before you head out. Appreciate it. I'm Mel, by the way. Tommy. This is my brother. Joe. I don't like it. They I don't all think you heard of us or something. Because they have. No, no, no. Laura, all clear? He's out. Put him against the wall. Tommy. Get off me. Get off me. Puta madre. Ch 
Joel Miller. Who are you? Guess. Say whatever speech you got rehearsed. Get this over with. Oh my gosh. Turn to get his leg. Do what? It. Please don't make me play. Come on. I'll be okay. I. I just want to know what happens. I don't want to play. Tommy. Oh my god, 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 okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Shit. There's like no way out of this. For Ellie, there there's just one of her. Why aren't you posted up outside? We didn't think anyone was gonna show up. What the hell did you expect? We gotta get out of here before the whole town's on top of us. You're done. You want what I want, right? End it. Now. Joel, get up. Joel, fucking get up. 
Please stop! Please don't shoot! Joel, please get up! <laughs> no! I just can't. Could I sit down, please? Yeah. to make sure you're eating. She can't stop us. <clears throat> they have the guys that we would need to do this smart. We'd be leaving Jackson vulnerable. So they just get to get away with this? Nobody wants that. Yeah, but that's what's happening. What if we get hit by hunters again? Is this you talking or is this her? It's a valid point. If it were you or me, Joel would be halfway to Seattle already. No, he wouldn't. He absolutely fucking would be. Well, we don't even know for certain that they're from Seattle. Washington Liberation Front. That's what you said was on those patches. What if they stole those jackets? That's... What's the WLF move? What are you doing? You know what? I'm leaving tomorrow. And if you want to come with me, great. You have no idea what you're walking into. You don't know how large that group is, how armed. I don't care. You can't talk me out of this. Give me a day to talk to Maria. Okay. There's got to be some folks you can spare. 
And if she won't budge? <laughs> well, I'll figure something out. One day. Please. Stop at his house before we leave. I just have to pick something up. Okay. I don't know, man. That sucked. <laughs> On the one hand, it sucks because it was extremely graphic and extremely violent, and I have a very delicate heart, and I don't like to see that kind of stuff. And on the other hand, I know there's a reason it was shown, even if it's not apparent yet in the story. I know it was a calculated choice that was made. And I'm sure I'll be able to make some sense of it later in the narrative. But not yet. You know, this setup has been theorized about and guessed about for so long. And I really didn't think it was going to go this way. I really didn't. Because it's setting up a revenge mission. Sure. But what's interesting is that it already was a revenge mission. That these Washington, whatever they are, group. They were on a revenge mission. For something Joel supposedly did. Did he even do this thing? We don't know. And now Ellie is going on a revenge mission against them, which just re-illustrates the pointlessness of it all. That nothing gets solved when you answer death with more death. But in a world like this, 
That's all they can see. In a world like this, where you have to take life and death into your own hands, all they can see is that justice is their job. And that to give someone's death meaning, another death must happen. And that's, that's lawlessness. That's not society. But it's the world they live in. It's probably very realistic. But it sucks. And now we have to go through why things were weird between them and Ellie is not gonna get the movie night that she had planned. And Ellie has to go through her story without him. Which is sad for her and for us because we have to go through it with her as we are the player and we experience things through her. It's gonna suck for us, it's gonna suck for me. Grief is hard and stories about grief are hard. But I'm sure it will still be a story worth going through. I'm sure it will. Um, Wow, um, still processing, obviously, that's, wow, a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> to quote Tommy from the very first scene. Um, what an intro. I mean, I feel like this was the intro of the game. It took us three and a half hours, but I feel like this was the intro. This is setting up the plot. <sighs> okay, I know what kind of ride we're in for now. <sighs> wow. Now what? I don't think I can keep going tonight. I need a breather. I need to... Wow. I don't know. I don't know if I can... Listen, I liked Joel as a character. I really did, but he wasn't like my favorite. I didn't identify with him. But the way that the game sets you up to be immediately put in Ellie's shoes, you know, empathetically, to, to live through her experience for, from the very beginning of the game, basically, it breaks your heart even if you didn't care for Joel. And I'm not saying I didn't care for him, I liked him, but I didn't identify with him like so many other people did. And it still breaks your heart in the same way that Ellie experiences it. Having to see it is so cruel. And yet it's so interesting that you also play as Abby throughout some portions of this. You try to survive as Abby. You play as her too. And are we going to, by the end of the game, be in her shoes empathetically too? And if so, what does that mean? Are we going to understand why she did what she did to Joel? Can you imagine it? Set something very interesting up. It sure does. 
Well, for what I believe are obvious reasons, I decided to end the playthrough there. Ugh, I have a lot of feelings. I have so many feelings. I know everybody else does too. Um, I talked through a little bit of them. <laughs> Can you believe those thoughts? All of those thoughts were just a little bit of what I'm thinking and feeling. Whew. Um, I am excited to see where this game heads next, even though I'm excited in a terrified way, if that makes sense. Um, thank you all for watching, for making sure that I didn't go through this journey alone because, ouch, I don't know if I could have done it. I don't know if I could have continued. I probably would have been like, mm, this game's too sad. I'm done. I don't need to keep going at all. <laughs> but I will keep going for all of you so that you can experience this playthrough um, through my lens. Whew. Um, <laughs> sad. Cry. A lot of it. Anyways. Thank you again for watching. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you're thinking, what you're feeling. Please be civil. Thank you as well um, to the amazing moderators on Twitch for making sure that it remains a spoiler-free environment for everybody watching as this was live streamed on Twitch first. And um, the YouTube moderators will be doing a similar job making sure that the comments of this video stay spoiler-free. So I do appreciate that very much. Um, whew, okay, please remember to like the video if you enjoyed it, and maybe not like, wow, it made you happy, but maybe just, you know, you enjoy this content and you'd like to see more. Um, so like it if you enjoyed it, share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it in the same twisted way at two, and uh, please remember to subscribe to Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video, and uh, feel free to hit the notification bell if you'd like. And uh, now everybody go do some self-care. Do something that makes you feel nice. Cuddle up with a warm blanket, drink some apple cider, whatever it may be. Holy moly, we need it. That's all. I love you all. Bye!